exporting messages from our phones is something we've all had to do from time to time. If you're looking to get your messages out from your phone and you're on Android, you'll need an app to get it done. Here's how to make it work. The easiest way to do this is through the free SMS Backup and Restore app on the Play Store. Just grab it using the link below and download it on your device. Once it's open, enable any permissions it requests for. To start, make a backup of your messages from the main page by tapping on Set Up a Backup. On the screen that pops up, select what you want to be backed up. To export your text messages, ensure that your messages are selected. Tap Next, then select where you'd like to save this backup. Aside from your phone storage, you can upload it to Google Drive, Dropbox, and OneNote. Saving to any location other than your phone will prompt you to log into the relevant account, so keep that in mind before you do so. Backing up to local storage on your phone will prompt you to choose a backup location. You can choose the app's internal folder or a separate folder you can set. Just tap on which option you prefer, then tap OK. Once you've set all the locations you'd like to save the backup to, tap Next. If you only opted for a locally saved backup, the app will throw up a warning and ask if you want to continue. Just tap yes and proceed. Set recurring backups if you wish or toggle it off, then tap backup now. Your phone will start exporting your text messages to a backup file. Once your messages have been backed up, tap on the triple lined icon at the top left and select print from backups. Select the backup you've created, then select the conversation thread you want to save as a PDF document. You'll then be shown a preview of the document itself. You'll see your contact's name, phone number, time, and date stamp, along with the message itself and whether it was sent or received. Feel free to look through it to see which pages you need. If you don't need the entire conversation history, you can deselect pages by tapping on the check icon in the bottom right of the page. It's important to note that automated messages like bank notifications won't display a phone number, while many might have multiple threads if the name displayed was changed at any point. If you're satisfied, set your printer to save as PDF if it isn't already, then tap on the print or save icon. From here, choose where to save the file to, then tap save. The conversation will immediately be exported as a PDF document. Rinse and repeat for any additional conversations. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Android and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.